we're trying to get Thunder Canyon open. And I gotta tell you, Thunder Canyon is fighting back. She's fighting back. <laughs> On top of that, we got a whole boatload of you guys calling and emailing and coming by asking like, how can I camp? Phone's ringing off the hook. So in this video, we are going to share our progress or lack thereof. <laughs> and we're gonna give you info on how you can camp with us. Welcome back to the RVR Couple. My name is John. And I'm Mercedes. And long story short, what was supposed to be a full-time RV adventure <laughs> has turned into a Yankee and a city girl running an RV park in the South. Well, we're not running an RV park. We're trying to build an RV park. Beautiful resort down in Alabama, and she's fighting back. Well, and the problem all started when my husband started praying for disappearance. <laughs> you guys remember, two years, the last two years have been absolutely insane. In the beginning of the Baby, craziness. the last 12 years with you have been absolutely <laughs> insane. The last two years have been absolutely crazy. Um, you guys, I, we don't have to tell you, but during the closure of everything, we had thousands, at least hundreds of people re reached out to us with emails that became displaced. Our beers got displaced due to the closures. The closure of the parks. And so when we left Florida after getting Sage and her therapy for nine months, we were heading to Colorado for the summer with our family. Because we hadn't seen them in so long because everything was shut down. Yeah. And so we, at that point, started looking. We were thinking about having a bug out place for ourselves, like five acres. Yeah. And then I started praying for discernment and boom, all of a sudden this idea came in. You know what? The, we got the RV Odd Squad. We're not the only ones that need a home base. We're not the only ones who are feeling like this. So let's look for a larger piece. And, of land. Yeah. And then it started to unfold. Here we are almost seven months later in Thunder Canyon. We're this close Baby, to it's been opening. Nine months. It has not been nine yes, months. Yes, it has been nine okay, months. Okay, whatever. We'll Eight months. A little compromise. <laughs> We've been here a long time, <laughs> and this park needed a lot, a lot of work. It needed now, love. Yeah, we're going to open 52, 52 full-service sites, and in its heyday, this park had 52 Jamming. sites. Well, it was my vision at first, and now it's become our vision. Would you agree? It's and we've been so focused. Still mostly your vision. We've never owned a campground. We have no idea. We've had a lot to learn. But I'll tell you what, with the RV Odd Squad's help, this park, Thunder Canyon Camp Gratitude, has come a million miles, guys. And we're this close to opening those doors. Well, but it's fighting back. And these are some of the challenges that we're dealing with. Mm -hmm. um, we have the huge challenge with the weather. Sometimes you only get two working days out of a week sometimes you get five sunny days a week and we are very weather dependent for the type of construction that we need done the other challenge that everyone's facing is the supply chain woes oh the supply um, chain has been a nightmare well that and the the inflation right what used to cost you four dollars is now forty five dollars that's exactly right and, and then and then to top it all off this is taking every ounce out of us and this hasn't just cost us um, our marriage, it's, you know, <laughs> our kids, our marriage. no, no, but what I'm trying to say is it's put a, yeah. a, a burden. Yeah, I know. I mean, that's, it's hard. And then it's also been a, um, a cost to our kids too, because, mm -hmm. and our family, um, because we've had to put this, it's a mission, you know? Um, I think it's a worthy mission. I think my husband was right pursuing this. I think he saw something that at the time I couldn't see. I thought he was crazy. Truth be told, the only reason I encouraged him to put an offer in on this property was because there were multiple bids and I thought to myself, don't worry, Mercedes, there's no way you're gonna get the offer. Mm -hmm. We got the offer. It inspired you and I couldn't see it. And you were right, but it's been a lot. It's been a lot. It was more than I ever could have imagined it would be. We run the channel, we run the, the campground, we're building out the campground. Um, and then we also started the RV Odd Squad, right? Which is a, it's an incredible group of people that that's the mission right it's, there. It's the mission. The more RV Odd Squad members we meet, the more people we just kind of fall in love with. And yeah. Mercedes and I, we could have made a million bucks in the last three years, guys, with our YouTube channel. We could have, we could have product, easily we could have made a million dollars, become, got all these sponsors. That's not how we do this. Yeah. What Mercedes and I do is we leverage the success and are sharing it with everyone who put us here. Well, it's a group thing. It's a group thing. Y'all put us here. We didn't do this by ourselves. Yep, and we need you. Yeah, and so- We really need you. The mission was crystal clear. It was to build a group of like-minded people 
bring back Judeo-Christian values, right? Our country's falling apart Everything along with down. Boy Scout values, yeah. you know? And I popped a video up before we'd even seen this and it went crazy. And one of the things I don't like about the censorship that's going on, on everything, especially YouTube, but what I do love about the YouTube algorithm is the more real we are, the more honest we are YouTube about everything, finds our, people our beliefs. For us. YouTube finds that algorithm finds people that are like us. Yeah. And the sorry, and, and, yeah, and, no, <laughs> sorry if you're watching. No, this. we're kind, we're considerate, right? We we love helping people. We love both of us love helping people, and we attract people that love helping others. And that's what this has been. We never could have gotten as far as we've gotten at this point without the RBI squad. It's a give more than you take. Yeah, every I mean, in the, the, the roller coaster ride of the ups and the downs have been brutal. Yeah, the lows have been horrible, but luckily the highs are just as great, like just as intense. Yeah, and, and, and each time, we, we've never stopped praying throughout this whole process. Every time we think we're at our wits' Some hands, of those prayers were a little colorful. God, I mean, <laughs> <laughs> what is happening? Some people have, have come at just the right time. Yeah. The right people have come into our lives at the right time. And that's what we pray for every day. And, um, you know, and every time we just think about out of gas and done, Someone the RVR squad the comes and just rejuvenates it. It helps us to remember why we are doing this. Yeah, what the long-term goal here is because it's bigger than us. And that is what gets us through. You know, we have so much going on that we really can't control. We can't control the supply chain. We can't control the price of lumber. We the can't weather control. in Alabama. Yeah, there's so much that we cannot control. But what can we control? What can we affect change? And really just focusing on what's in front of us. But I'm not going to sugarcoat this i don't know if we're going to be able to open in time anyways we are going to open on time there will be campers here why because we've already started booking campers here if you're an rv odd squad member who has supported this mission and helped us get this thing going you know that you're welcome to come here now but next sunday all rv odd squad members are going to have access to making reservations at this park before anybody else does and the way you do that is to be an RV Odd Squad member, well, yeah. you're kind, you're considerate, you love helping other people, yeah. right? God, family, community. Yeah, and, and we also kind of need your email to send you the info. Yeah, if you're not on our <laughs> list, if you can't give us your email. It's hard to contact you. You can still be an RV Odd Squad member, but no. you don't know what's going on behind the scenes. You don't yeah. get you know a, a newsletter that we send out weekly about the behind the scenes stuff that's going on. And so if you're an RV Odd Squad member and you consider yourself an RV Odd Squad member, Give us your email below because before next Sunday's video, when we announce to the world the dates that we're open in Thunder Canyon, letting everybody book, we're sending out an email to all our RV Odd Squad members. Those who first. are on our list will have access to the booking system first before anybody else. And so if you're not on our list, go right below. Uh, in the description, you're going to see join the RV Odd Squad. Get the newsletter. Get the newsletter. Get plugged in. And then you guys are going to get to see the new membership that we've created. We're hoping that we can keep this a members only campground for so many reasons. The insurance price. It drops $80,000 if we can keep this a members only campground, right? There's a lot of reasons for members only. Um, we want to have, we said Judeo Christian values, Boy Scout principles. So we have a statue of the Ten Commandments. We have well, three of them. Well, we, we do. But like, we don't want to get sued because somebody got offended at the statue. And, and that's one of those things that membership protects us from is that, well, it, you know, if you're a member, you know what you're getting into. Mm -hmm. and, and, and there's a lot of things behind the scenes. Well, on the bright side, we have to remember that we have a campground and we have openings or we're going to have openings at a time where people can't find a place to camp. So everything is happening in our best interest. It just doesn't feel like it sometimes. No, it's all good. It's all going to work out just the way it's supposed to. We're falling forward, people. <laughs> <laughs> it's usually two steps forward, one step back. Yeah. Another challenge that we're having is that you guys have a bunch of questions because our phone is ringing off the hook and uh, we don't have time to answer and, and kind of say the same thing to everyone. So we need to tell you guys here. Um, one of the biggest questions we're getting asked, because some of you guys are going online trying to book a site at Thunder Canyon, is how do I get a membership number? How do I get a membership number? Right now, only people with a membership number can camp at Thunder Canyon. Now, we are going to be opening that up, and the first people that are going to know more about that are the people on our email list. That's why we need your email, right? Another really common question that you guys are asking us is, hey, what do I have to do to become a member? Because there's a little bit of ambiguity about membership. 
The bottom line is RV Odd Squad membership is and will always be free. You're a member if you subscribe to the channel. But if you're a member, it doesn't mean you get to camp at Thunder Canyon for free. There's costs. So well, exactly. And I can't talk to you unless you give me your email and I can send you a newsletter. <laughs> so that's why we really need to be able to get you the newsletter is because you can be a member, but it's not going to do you much good if I can't reach out to you. And we are doing everything in our power to keep the cost as low as we can so everybody can enjoy Thunder Canyon, guys. It's a beautiful place. It's really pretty. So the big news is this, guys, is that RV Odd Squad members are going to have first shot at making reservations at Thunder Canyon before everyone else. Next Sunday, we are announcing the opening of Thunder Canyon, at which time you'll be able to come in, become a member if you want to camp here, and immediately make your reservation and come camp with us. But for first dibs and considering how crowded campgrounds are, yeah, you're going to want to know. We have yeah. absolutely no doubt that this place is going to fill up fast. And then when the word gets out about how absolutely gorgeous this place is it guys it's like a state park it's absolutely amazing there's something special about thunder canyon that has to be experienced so if you're a member of the rv odd squad and you've wanted to come visit us at thunder canyon guys we're, we're a week out now and for those of you who are already subscribed to our newsletter you're going to know in the next two to three days what it's going to take for you to become a member and then set a reservation to come and hang out with me and Mercedes. We plan on being here for the next year. We're going to be here for a while. If you haven't subscribed to our newsletter, you remember the RV Odd Squad, and you want to know before the public does next Sunday, just go ahead down below and join the RV Odd Squad. Sign up for our free newsletter, and you will receive a notification in the next couple, three days telling you all of the exciting things we put together. Guys, if you're a newbie RVer and you're considering getting into the RV lifestyle, whether yeah. it's full-time or part-time, you'd be absolutely insane not to become a member of the RV Odd Squad. When you become a member of the RV Odd Squad, you are like family to us. And we treat you like family. And we treat you like family. And we give you everything that we get. We share our success with our audience. This campground is not ours. This campground is God's, but he wants us to share it with the other people that believe like we do. Hey, can I see something real quick? Mm -hmm. I think everybody needs to see this really, check out this really cool. Stop making fun of my band. No, I like it. Mercedes bit me. No. <laughs> she bit me this morning, man. Stop biting. I would have had a much bigger band. -aid. No, don't bite me anymore. Be nice. I'm very stressed. I I'm, very I'm trying to get this place open and I have a wife who doesn't believe in me. It's not that I don't believe in you. I'm just making a very thorough to-do list and I'm getting a little scared. I don't know. Well, you can get scared. There's nothing I can do about your scare. All I can control is what I can control and all I can do right now is get up at sunrise. I know. And work till 12 or 1 o'clock in the morning. Get as much as I possibly can done. Yeah. And trust that God's going to take care of the rest and I think he's going to. If you haven't subscribed to our channel, subscribe right now. You will want to get a notification of next Sunday's video. You do not want to miss your opportunity to become part of the best RV community on the planet. With a mediocre YouTube channel. We'll see you in the next video. <laughs>